Welcome to this video guys. In this video, I'll show you three methods to check your Windows specification. They will show you different things. First, go to your Explorer by pressing Windows E or by your Start menu and you'll see this PC here. Right click on this PC and this method works on both Windows 10 and Windows 11. Right click and click on Properties. Here, you will see these information. As you can see, first, you get to see your processor information. I am on i7 12th generation and 2.10 gigahertz installed RAM is 16 GB, 15.7 usable. This is my device ID and this is my product ID. And I am on 64 bit OS and my processor is also 64 bit. So these two are different, right? A 64 based processor can host a 32 bit operating system and a 64 bit operating system. But if your processor is only 32 bit, then you can only install 32 bit operating system. So this is the hardware information and this is the Windows specification, which Windows is installed, what is the version, when was it installed and so on. So this is the first method. Now you can also come to the screen by just pressing Windows and I, right? And then click on system and then scroll down and then click on about. So those are the two methods to open this page. Now let's see how you can see a bit more of this information. So let's close this and press Windows and R and Windows and R will open this run dialog and now here type DXDIAG. Now if you want to see information about graphics card, your display and some more information, just press DX tag and a dialog box will open. As you can see DX tag has opened this tool. Now here I can see current date, computer name, operating system and so on. Also I can see some processor information. Now here we can see information looked a little more better. So RAM is 16, 384 MB. And now to see your display information or your graphics card information, you can click on display. And similarly, you can check your sound. See, so I have speakers and real tech audio driver is installed and you can check inputs. So mouse is attached, keyboard is attached. You can see all these information here. Uh, if you want to check information about graphics card, you can find it here. Now, finally, another method is to open system information. So you can press your Windows key and search for system information and click on this to open it or you can do it using your run command. So press Windows R again and this time instead of DX tag search for MS Info 32 and then click on OK. So again this will open. So it's the same thing as you can see system information. Now here you can see the basic summary or but in a lot more detail as you can see OS name, OS version and my hardware is x64 so on so i have i7 1260p with 12 cores 16 logical processors and yeah you can see installed memory available memory available physical memory total virtual memory and so on and is your virtualization enabled or not and you can also check a lot of more details by just choosing one of these things so you have your hardware resources your components and so on here but we have seen a lot of things, but we are yet to see information about our hard disk, right? How much space do we have? So for that, you can press your Windows key and type CMD. Sorry, not CMD, PowerShell. PowerShell and click on Run as Administrator. And here you just type GET OLUMB. Hit enter. And as you can see, you have drives, two drives, drive C and drive D. Drive C has size remaining of 9.24 GB and total size is 230 GB and Drive D has 37.92 GB size remaining and total size is 244 GB. So this is how you can know whatever you need to know about your system. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.